These new CS2 skins are crazy. What's up guys, it's your favorite short form clickbait YouTuber with some new workshop skins uploaded in the last couple of days. CS2 workshop tools are out for some days now and people are already doing crazy stuff and here are some of my favorite new CS2 skins. All the links are in the description so make sure to vote up your favorite ones. Starting off we got the P90 Noir. Now we already got many graffiti P90 skins but this one sticks out to me because it has my favorite age Sally on it and since it's a very cool idea I can see it in a vertical collection for sure. 9 out of 10. Next up we got the AK-47 Magma Warrior, a very simple but good idea. For CS2 this is insane, the only thing holding me back is the fact that we already got the slate and red line but why not adding the Magma Warrior for cool sticker crafts as well, 7 out of 10. I feel like I don't talk enough about good artwork skins and the UMP Lost Chapter is one of them. You must be very talented to pull off such artworks and we can see many good details on the rest so very nice, 9 out of 10. Moving from cool artworks to a very very special skin in my opinion which is the P2K Danger Zone. Now the skin itself isn't too special, it's more about the rarity because we've seen the MP5 Lab Rat as a special skin when Danger Zone was released and it Valve would bring this one as a limited edition for Danger Zone enjoyers it would be very cool, 9 out of 10. Oh shit this video will be long, I didn't do this for some days. Next up we got the Mech 7 Cyclone, if you saw my last videos about workshop skins you will know that I love this one. One. What a banger skin on an underappreciated weapon, give this man an award and also Valve please accept this skin, we need more like this. 10 out of 10. Now the same applies to the MP9 Cryogenic, banger skin on the MP9 which is probably my favorite CT SMG so I would love to own this one, a futuristic simple skin which looks amazing, 10 out of 10. It doesn't stop here because next up we got the P250 Sakura Zaka, now pistol skins are not underrated nowadays but I love the theme and I think we really really need a Japanese skin collection, not that there are no skins like this already in the game but we need more, 9 out of 10. After all these banger skins, the AK-47 Forgotten War doesn't feel too special anymore but I think it is, maybe not as a high tier skin but a simple cool AK, 6 out of 10. Moving on we got the Orb Hellsings Inferno, pattern based and kind of like the Orb Paw and there's nothing you can do wrong with that, very cool skin and I must say I love pattern based skins, 9 out of 10. Last but not least a very controversial one, who would have guessed, or should I say 6 controversial ones, because Transon released 6 AWPs in different colors so I'll go with the tempered for now that have a 3D Valorant effect. I already talked about a concept from him and I have to repeat myself, for me this isn't Counter Strike anymore but I still respect his work and quality and talented wise this is a 10 out of 10. What do you think? Tell me in the comments and if you enjoyed watching subscribe and like for more news and interesting stuff about Counter Strike. See ya!